Welcome to this presentation of the Caldera print workflow using the HP Latex 360. The first part will show you how to load an image. First, open FileMan by double-clicking on its icon. Use the file selector and its shortcuts to find and select your file. Then click Open. When the upload is complete, your file is automatically added to the image bar. You can use display to visualize the image. The second part will quickly show you the print module. To open the print module, double-click on the printer icon in the application bar. Then use the drag and drop to add the image. On this main window, set up the initial print parameters number of copies, the resolution, the loading, the media, the mode and the quality and show the type of action. Use this button to manage global colors. Choose the profiles used for color management, enable the color management and or the use of curves and set additional color related settings. Use this button to manage spot colors. Set the lab options, see the delta E and the spot color location on the image. With this button you access to additional printer parameters. For example, you can wake up the printer and open its web server page. Change the media settings and monitor the status. Use this button to open the page configuration. Manage the main layout parameters. Add crop marks, color bars, annotations, or even a control target. Manually resize the image and set its orientation using the preview tools. Enable step and repeat to have a better control on repetitions. Manage the cut by enabling or disabling some cut controls, for example. And finally, you can make some color corrections if you want. The third part will show you how to set the dual side printing. Whatever you choose to rip or print the image, the dual side printing window opens. There, choose if you want a simple print or if you want to use the dual side. For the dual side, first indicate if you are sending the A side or the B one. You can also choose to automatically create the B side and select some options. The whole workflow allows you to print all the A sides first, where the B sides are kept in the spooler, then print all the B sides in one click after you turn the wall over. The fourth part will show you Caldera Spooler. It opens with this button. The spooler is Caldera's jobs queue. It shows the job's progress. You can also see the job information detailed in several tabs. Caldera Thrip software also allows you to do manual and automatic nesting, create automation with the workflows and odd folders, style your job, manage the cut, and more. This concludes our print workflow presentation video. Thank you for your attention.